Okay, problem 9.1.5. Okay, so it's test the claims, construct confidence intervals for the difference between two proportions. So the article was published about stress to different types of gloves. For the vinyl gloves, 69% leaked. For the latex gloves, 12% leaked. And that both, both uh, same sample size. So we're going to use the 0 0.05 significance level. And the first population is population one. So Population one has a greater percentage, so P1 greater than P2 is the claim. The claim that vinyl gloves have a greater, so P1 greater than P2 is the claim. So that will be the alternative. So once again, the null is always equal. P1 equals P2. Now we got to find the test statistic. And we got we to gotta use the calculator here because they didn't give us the number of leaks. They gave us the percentage. So we have to calculate it. So we take 294. The first one was 69%. So it looks like 203. And the second one was 294 times 12%. Looks like 35. So 203 and 35. We'll just round according to the rounding rules that we are used to. So I go to stat, proportion stats, two samples with summary. So for the sample number one, it was 203 out of 294. Sample number two, it was 35 out of 294. The null is essentially equals algebraically. That's the same as P1 equals P2. But it's a right tail test because we're saying P1 is greater than P2. So algebraically, the difference is greater than 0. And we will then compute. And the test statistic to two decimal places is 14.11. Hopefully that's correct. Very good. And then the p-value is zero to three decimal places. So we're going to reject because we're less than 0 0.05. So the p-value is less than the significance level alpha. So we reject the null hypothesis. We have sufficient evidence to support the claim, which is in the alternative. Okay, so that is problem 9.1.5, Dr. K, over and out.